Okay, so good afternoon. This is our live session, April 15, 2020, 4 o'clock, 4.15 actually right now. So let's check the attendance. This is section 1, correct? Section 1? Yes, okay. So Aisha. John, our usuals, I shine as John, perfect attendance, nice to see you here, Fahad missed two meetings, but uh, he's here with us, one is only the first meeting you missed, now Ras, Alkindi, the two meetings, uh, seventh week, I know, eighth week. Okay, so the, the meeting today is about our exercise. So I'm just going to remind you the deadline of that is on Monday, 20th of April. So if you have a question, you ask that question now, or you have to wait until the next Monday again to ask the question, or if I have a chance this weekend. Okay, so. So everybody, can you reply? Do you have a question for the exercise? Yes or no? Chat, chat. Please type it if you don't want to talk over the microphone. Isa said, said no. So uh, if I give you an exercise, by the way, uh, first thing that you have to do once I upload it, it upload it, check it already. Okay, browse it, watch the video lessons that is uh, required for that. Uh, watch the video lessons and then see if you have, you'll have some misunderstanding on some of the tasks. And then you ask the question during our meeting. Uh, do not wait until the day of the submission, then you'll ask the question until you just have two hours before the deadline, then you will ask the question. If uh, what happens is that I'll, I will not be able to check my email or my inbox, then alas, you'll miss the deadline. Uh, so hopefully you can practice, uh, you, could, you can do that best practice of uh, trying to uh, work on time, okay? So if you don't have any question, the other topic is that I uploaded again, some a, a video is lesson number five. It's a short lesson, mean, median, and mode. So I will uh, upload some of uh, the 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 lesson six videos. It's just giving me a lot of uh, time to. I'm experiencing <laughs> a lot of problem with editing, or I found that some mistake in the recording. So actually, online classes, if we all can agree, is a little bit more tasky. Plus the fact that um, plus the fact that since we are not in the university, we are we need to manage our own time. Uh, we need to get out of different distractions. Like of course, for example, my family. If my son wants to play with me, I'm at home, so of course he will bother me. Uh, so that's a problem. Um, and then you have your couch, you have your bed asking you or like waving on you to like come here, just uh, rest or just sleep. Okay, don't do anything. So that's what my couch and our bed is telling me every time we see each other. <laughs> So aside from that, uh, actually online classes is like five times the work that we are doing in the university. Imagine in the university, I'll go there 
Uh, I know already the sequence of the teaching. I already taught this classes uh, for like several years, several semesters. So when I come there, okay, uh, what's the topic for today? I will do a little planning, okay? Very minimal planning. I'll upload lectures in the Moodle and then I'll upload exercise. Then I will mark. That's how simple is it? It's this. And then I will record your grades. Now, the online classes is different. Live session meeting. Okay, so that I can be like in touch with you anytime. Lessons we will have. Uh, Aisha, wait. Uh, let me just answer Aisha already. Uh, we are now in lesson five. Mean median mode. Lesson six is date and conditional formatting. Lesson seven is conditional formatting. Uh, lesson eight is text manipulation. Text manipulation. Okay, let me see the content. Text manipulation. And next is, let me just. Accurately check for the topics. Okay, so right now we're finishing on date and conditional formatting. The basic, ah, I have to discuss conditional formatting. So that's lesson number seven. So advanced conditional formatting. Then lesson seven, right? Lesson eight is text manipulation, text uh, functions, how to manipulate text. And then we have lesson eight. Lesson nine is pivot table. And then lesson 10, if statement. So until lesson 10. Okay, for the this semester. Okay, did I answer your question, Miss Aisha? So until lesson ten. So again, lesson six, date and conditional formatting. Lesson seven is conditional formatting advanced. Lesson eight, text manipulation. Lesson nine, pivot table. Lesson 10, if statement. Lesson 11 is actually macros. Am I correct? Am I missing something? Let me just double check. Pivot macros, lecture pivot, if statement. Okay, yeah, that's correct. Lesson 11 is actually the macro. I told you in the orientation, if we will reach that topic, but I decided already that we will not have macro. Uh, this semester because uh, first of all you have done already introduction to programming so I would love to teach you that because it will just be very easy to you uh, in Excel but however since we are doing online classes so I'm reducing the topics that's one of the reason uh, and yeah let's deem it with those topics for the final exam okay so I'm just uh, reducing the topics. Anyway, so I'm planning also pro on doing the front loading of the lessons and the exercises. So I will, my goal is to like finish all the lessons, the video lessons this week, hopefully, but maybe until next week. Okay, but I will put it in Moodle by week. Okay, not only in one week. So you have your own time uh, to go on with it. If you want, you can advance uh, this uh, lessons. Uh, do it uh, in advance, in advance, uh, rather than waiting for the time that we will do it weekly. Okay, so that's my goal. That's only a goal, but uh, hopefully I can do it. Uh, the advantage of that is you can work it within your pace uh, and 
like if you want to finish Excel as soon as possible, then you can do it. So you can concentrate with your other courses. And then we'll just wait for the final exam if we come back on a particular time. So this decision, I already discussed that in our guidelines for online classes. So it depends. But for now, uh, what is important is I'll give you the lessons, the exercises, and uh, the project. Hopefully, once I finish the visual lessons, I will now give uh, an instruction on the project. Now, lastly, um, the final exam has to be still there. I mean, like we still are pending on that. So assume, okay, always assume or will think, always think that you're preparing for the final exam. This lesson is, uh, has to be considered in the final exam. And the final exam covers from lesson one until the last lesson, okay? From exercise two until the last exercise. So that's the coverage of the final exam, okay? So do you have uh, any question on the approach that I was planning? Uh, I told you, ah, no, before I was interrupted, I was telling I uh, telling all of you how difficult, not all difficult, I mean, like, it's more tasky. It uh, requires more time, the online classes, for us as a teacher. So you will record uh, a lesson, a video, then you have to watch. The video let's say you recorded 15 minutes video and then you recorded five parts okay so one two three four five so more than one hour so you have to watch this okay if there's an error you have to edit it if the editing is really not an option then you have to redo the video again so one two three times already that you're working on the video then you will edit it so fourth then after editing you will upload so fifth so when you upload it's not just like upload one click you have to wait uh you can do some other jobs but eventually you have to come back there and then verify everything and i'm uploading it in moodle and upload it in youtube also so this is really a task you how many tasks that i gave you already and like in online face to face I have a little plan. I upload the lecture in the Moodle. We meet, we have a lecture, and then we go back to, uh, like, I'll, you will submit the exercise. I will mark this exercise, then I will record. Right now, I have still exercise giving you. I will still mark it and record it, aside from preparing the video lessons. Okay? And then we'll have the live meeting right now. Okay, so this is really what I'm saying is that Online class is also tasky for us, so it's not that easy. Okay, so although the advantage is um, you can repeat the lessons, okay? I mean, since it is recorded, you can play it back, play it back, play it back until you get the idea. Okay, and like uh, when you're just in the classroom and I don't have the video lessons, then if you didn't hear it, or you didn't pay attention that finish, you will not understand. Okay? So do you still have a question? I'm going to end this meeting right now. So please try to reply yes or no. Do you have a question? Awani said no, Shen said no. Aisha, no. Okay. So this is a new feature of Teams. You can set a background, you can wave. Like for example, I'm on a, what's this, a beach? Yeah. <laughs> like it? Okay, so anyway, thank you very much for being here. So have a nice day. Bye.